Welcome back, everybody. Yeah, welcome back to uh, Couch Ops, and we're playing Money Hunter Nana. Yep, Money Hunting Simulator, and it's got a pretty cool design. So, uh, <laughs> you know, at this point, we're looking for your money that might have rolled into it. <laughs> yeah, you look so pathetic, stop that right now. You look like you're looking for money. I was just <laughs> you sound like my mother. Stop laughing, Mio, and stop her. Hmm, it's too dark for me to see anything. Yeah, yeah your well, phone flashlight. She's already doing some flashing. Would you mind? Would you mind shining a light back there? She's not <laughs> listening. She's she's locked in on the money. Yep. How about the selfie stick you're always using, banana? Nice idea, but I don't have it with me today. Uh, Why? Hmm, uh, this is so frustrating. Let's come back if we find something useful. Like a tripod? What? It, What's it? Sorry. What is it that's driving you to search so much? Uh, ancient vending machine. <laughs> ancient vending machine full of secret treasures. All right, we got another event added to the extras menu. Ooh. Cool. So, can I use the tripod? The tripod was used for that's something else. Memory. Remember? Yeah. Okay, so I got you the hat. So, because we're only missing six items, seven items. Wait a minute. What about the candle? Yeah, you do have a candle. <laughs> of course it works. I nope. wonder if there's any money here. Singing for. Oh, alright, so I don't. This is exactly Wait. the kind of space we did some words. Sorry. I hope we find something. Can Use I... the candle now. What about the crayon? See, yep. <laughs> there. Alright, yeah. I guess, uh. <laughs> We gotta find something else then. So and so, I think the game's gonna become much more obtuse now, because we have. I'm assuming we have most of the story done. But with how this game is doing stuff, it probably now spawned in the item we need. Yeah, probably. Because <laughs> it's done that several times already, hasn't it? So actually, I'm gonna go back over here. I'm gonna check out this like waiting room, and then I'll go check out the basement, and then we can start making our way upstairs. On a little bit of a hunt. It's a luxurious chandelier. Let's yeah, use it. that. It seems darker in here now. Does it? Painting that fell down, yep. I do think uh, it's a gigantic meme, like, just use your phone. Yeah. <laughs> like, you're holding it already. Yeah. It would be super easy. The goofiest thing I've ever seen. It's it's to ad advance plot. <laughs> I got so I, I'm guessing... There was plenty of plot there. Truly. <clears throat> I'm guessing we're going to be doing all kinds of like goofy little side tasks now <laughs> like that, that are going to improve the ending somehow because we're playing a game with the little girl so she probably won't come and kill us all when we leave. Kill all three of them. Yep. I, I don't know why I would think that would be helpful. <laughs> it hasn't been yet. It's worth searching everything, isn't it? Kind of, actually. With how this game is. You should check the basement again. Oh yeah, shoot, I was going to do that. Just don't examine the hair and get the bad end yet again. <laughs> Fifteen years ago, alright, that's how long ago it was. Okay, yeah. So, like, early 2000s. So if we close this... And that we never locked. got into here, right? Do we have so a key in the inventory, though, don't we? I got... Oops. Right? Oh, these are both <clears> locked. I yeah, have you know how office desks, room though. key. Yeah. I don't know if that'll work, though. Yeah. We probably need huh. a desk drawer or cabinet key filing cabinet key oh boy so we can assume that's one of the items and then let me guess we're gonna find a flashlight that we'll use <laughs> for the vending machine the silliest nonsense that's already all done okay so this room we can rule out like that's just <sighs> it's gonna be it's, goofy it's just padding Heading the game. Yep. Like, oh, we all have lights, but we're not going to use them on the vending machine. Uh huh. Sure. Mm -hmm. That makes perfect sense. Yeah. It's, uh. <clears throat> ay, ay, ay. I game, tell you. Game design. It's game design, that's for sure. See, but I think we shouldn't have to worry about getting attacked by the, the mascot at all anymore now, so it should be easy enough to just walk around, do stuff. So we'll give her a little like, screen time. I don't dislike any of them, but if I had to rank them, Azu says the bottom. She's a straight man. That's she, true. She's that personality. Like, and Nana's the joke too. Well, she's the 
the joke to her straight man. I, I guess I should <clears> say she's more the voice of reason. Mio is more like the straight man. Because mm. she's, she's, no, Mio's the voice of reason. Mio's the, Mio's the voice of reason. She's got that pro tag vibe very hard. Azusa's the straight man, like. And Nana's just and Nana's the, really the easy going one. The, she's the gremlin. Yep. We she's love a good Uber. gremlin. Because, <laughs> yeah, like, I can't say, oops, I did not press up. <laughs> That's not what the game says. Control stick, you know? I can use the D-pad. Right. Um... Is this the hair room? Yes. Is the hair going to be all gone? No. No. So that's not important. And then... Wait, actually, can you go to your inventory really, real quick? Yeah, I thought so. You still have the scissors. That's funny to me because, like, oh, the doorway is covered with hair. You still have the scissors. Yeah. <laughs> can we just... And the glass shard, too. Like, wouldn't we have just been able to do that? I wonder if that I mean, crayons I'm, I'm probably use. nitpicking a little too hard. It's just to show that you have gotten it, most likely. But Wait a minute. What if I have to use like the glow-in-the-dark spray? I don't think so. That would make zero sense in the circumstances, I think. I agree. That would be goofy. Like, just, okay, spray everything under there and make it glow. That wouldn't help, though. <laughs> because, first and foremost, that kind of stuff needs to absorb light to glow. It was glowing earlier, though. I mean, you could shine the light on it. Then. <laughs> <laughs> so we're back to the camera lights. All right. Anything on this shelf here? No. It's I mean, just... at least in real life, that's how that glow-in-the-dark stuff works. Yeah. And also, it's made from, like, plutonium or something, which is kind of wild. I'm assuming this is all... I, got, I don't need to research those uh, cabinets. I forget which one, but yeah. One of the radioactive elements is used to make glow-in-the-dark, which is hilarious. Phosphorus? No, that's not radioactive. It's it's, not. it's it's uranium or plutonium. I forget which one. Yeah, I'm not really sure. Probably uranium. Yeah, because isn't plutonium like significantly rare? Well, I think like most. I I could be entirely wrong here, but I'm pretty sure like most plutonium in like the universe is just decayed because oh. it has a really really short half life. Oh, that could be then. Um, so that is probably uranium, yeah. Like, I think there is still plutonium, but I think just given, like, how how the beta decay happens on it, or alpha decay, or whatever, I don't remember, I'm not, I'm not good at chemistry, um, a lot of it's decayed at this point in time. Yeah. That is true. That makes sense. Ooh, what's this? Circular bed. I mean. Go into the... Other room. The room that uh, she was stuck in. Yeah, so long ago. That was a long time ago, wasn't it? That was like, oh, this was the room she was stuck in, that bathroom yep. right there. Uh-huh. And that's it. Jeez. That's it. This is rough. That's fine. We almost have this floor explored, the whole thing. It's pretty, I mean, it is a pretty small place. There's like three floors. Yeah. Or the eyes are sort of, no, they didn't. They just don't glow in the dark. They glow in the light. They glow in... Yeah, they, they're very reflective. Just like they in animals. I went up already, didn't I? Uh, did I? Oh. I don't, kind of talk I don't think I did. It's okay. We'll figure it out. We're experts at figuring out obscure things. Yeah, if I figure out, you mean look it up online. That's part of the <laughs> process. <laughs> Who, wait, you're, you're giving away the magician's code. I, I, I mean, communing with the ancient ones. All right, should I go down and check everything down there first, do you think? Or should I go up and just check the third floor first? Up. Yeah. I mean, it is closer. Probably will be faster. Well, the third floor does have a lot of stuff, a lot of rooms you can go in. So that's a lot of chances at finding a... We're going we're gonna to find a phone with a working flashlight on it. And we're going to have to use that. <laughs> be like, hey, Nana, isn't this your friend's phone? Wait, we can use this to shine the light underneath the vending machine to find the money. That's our, genius. Our phones weren't good enough for it, but this one. <laughs> I don't want to stick my phone under there, but her phone, <laughs> screw her. She was never really my friend anyway. I hope she's dead. Yeah. When oh. I saw that bloody and maggoty hat, secretly, I was relieved. <laughs> God. I once lent her five dollars. She never paid me back. This is what she gets. That room's still. But Nana, this is Japan. Why did you have five dollars? 
<laughs> What's going on here? Where where did you get that American money from? <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. Okay. Great. Well, we're, we've almost explored the whole place, so... We... Oh, what's this, a cabinet? I mean, the this shelf? is Renana was, it was Renana almost was. dead. And that's the window that we had to use to cut open the the door. Or did bar Yeah, it was to cut it open because there was hair stuck all over it. Yay. Wasn't Doors. it plastic? Was it plastic? I believe it was plastic. It might have been yeah, plastic. Yeah, like, it's tied shut with plastic. That's right. weird. It is weird. It is kind of weird. Oh, we'll do such thing. I'm not going to save. Mm-hmm. Nothing of a point. It'd be Nothing of value just, was gained. Yeah, if, it, if we reloaded, it would just be going back to the first floor right next to the vending machine. Cool. Okay, well, those locked doors have to have something going on. Like, I wonder if we'll be able to get into those later. I don't know. Let's examine our keys again? We didn't use all of them, did we? I believe we have. We've used the 206 key, the 302 key. The 202 key we've used. We used the second floor emergency oh, key. Sure. And we used the hotel office oh, key. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. the mainspring key. It's a small metal screwdriver. It's not actually a key. It's not, but it's called the key. It, it, it didn't say it key anywhere. It just said mainspring. Yeah, and there it didn't. They called it a key earlier, but also on, <laughs> on like wind-up things like that. No, I know the that. Key. But I'm just saying it in... Like does friend have the way to light it the up? It's the doll. I, it's kind of weird. I'm, I'm really... Uh, Wait. I love it. Oh my god. Duct tape. What's that going to do? <sighs> Rubber tape. What's that for? It's an item. It's next on the list. We needed it. For a long time, the surface is sticky. Oh, are they going to... Are they going to like sticky? get a stick and put the tape all over it? And now about you getting that's gonna open up a different item now somewhere. Yeah. So they're gonna use the tape, and she's just gonna stick it under there and pick up change that way. That could be. She's rolling around like a lint roller and get your money. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. It's gonna ridiculous. be ridiculous. I I I have a very strong feeling that's the direction that's gonna be going. And since it's Nana, I could totally see it happening that way. She's a little engineer, isn't she? Yep. <laughs> All right. Well, and uh, yeah, there's probably yep. something else that got opened up now. Picking that up. Fifteen minutes of walking around. That's fine. It's great. <laughs> we made progress. We did right totally at the end. That it tape like, saved it. What's this? Path been completely blocked. That's fine. It's not fine. Imagine where you could go if that path wasn't blocked. To like downstairs quicker. <laughs> yes, probably. Cool. We are Love learning it. so much. It's insane. Now that we got something on the third floor, we can go find something in the basement. Probably. <clears throat> Padding the game for like the way. Let's go. Here we are. It, it is a relatively short game. It's just, right? yeah, you spend so much time blundering around. I, should I just start rechecking everything now on the way back? Oh, God. Do you think, do you I think hate that. It. <laughs> Do you think that would be worth it? I, I just hate that that's like... Or maybe she'll just take the tape and like just wrap it around her hand and just slap it under there. <laughs> go bit. try it. Go try the tape on the machine. All right. Well, we'll figure out what to do with the tape next time. Yeah. Because uh, I'm, I'm not really sure. I, I have a feeling that's going to be involved with this puzzle. Or she'll spray the glow in the dark spray all over the tape. <laughs> uh, anyways, if you like duct tape, then like this video. <laughs> like the duct tape. And and we'll see you on the next one. Yep. Bye bye. <laughs>